This is Nginx threading architecture. Nginx spins up usually by default a worker process or a worker thread for each core on your computer. And the master process will be responsible for reading configurations from Nginx and also binding to that socket listener. And when it does that, it creates a socket listener in a shared memory that is shared with all these worker processes. So when an, actually an existing connection tries to be established by the client, the, a thread will call accept on the listener socket. Actually, all the threads will be calling accept on that listener socket, trying to accept new connections to serve them. The problem is this is a shared memory. That means it has to be locked and it can only be accessed one thread at a time. So there is competing to accept connections. That is that is creates a little bit of a bottleneck in this case. Obviously, once a thread accepts a connection, that connection will be stored in the worker thread and request on that connection will be served by that worker thread all the time. If you think about it, that creates kind of a, a problem with load balancing because some connections will have requests that are heavy, some will have a lighter weight requests. In new versions of Nginx, each thread can listen on the same port in its own listener socket through something called socket sharding, and that kind of paralyzes connections.